Hi, in this video for the TV Star T2 505 HD Digital Terrestrial Receiver, we're going to talk a little bit about the media player. So to access this, simply go into Menu, or over to USB and down to Multimedia. Okay, so the important thing to know about the uh, media player functionality on this particular box, obviously you'll have to have a memory stick or hard drive or something like that plugged in with your media on it, whether it be music, photos or videos, something like that. Um, but the thing to note, and it's very important to understand, is depending on what subset of multimedia you pick, that's the only thing that will be displayed on the screen. Okay, so if you pick the music submenu, you'll only see your type of your music files, the same with photos, the same with movies. So once you understand that then, it's very easy after that. So we'll just pick music here for a start. Um, and what I'm going to do basically is just press OK. So I can just see I have a little MP3 sample here and I'm just going to kick it off there playing. So I'm just going to turn the volume up here so you can hear it. Okay, so hopefully you're able to hear that. So it'll play MP3, so that's a, a neat little feature. So just to stop the playback there of the MP3, you simply just hit the stop button. And what you can do then is hit the exit button to go back to the multimedia menu. So the next one we'll look at is photos. So it plays all the normal types of photos, but the most common one that people would have would be uh, JPEGs, okay? So you can just simply hit OK and it'll display all your photos on the screen and things like that. And uh, you can even do a slideshow if you have a lot of them and things like that. So I'm just going to hit exit there to get out with that. I'm just going to hit exit again to go back to the multimedia menu and I'm going to go into the movie section here, okay? So from our testing anyway, we would have, um, one of the things we do is we have a little drive with a load of sample movies on it with different types of codecs, okay? So what, what a codec is, is basically, you'll either have a video codec or an audio codec and um, there's different variations of both and then there's different combinations of both, okay? So what people generally um, have files of, they're generally something like AVI files, but the important thing to note it, uh, is that an AVI is not just an AVI. The AVI will contain these things called codecs. So it'll have a video codec and an audio codec. And what's important to note about that basically is there's a multitude of different variations within that file, okay? So, and it may not play them all. So the thing to note is basically, well, what, what, what kind of things will it play? So we've thrown a lot of this and it will play most of them, but by far what we would see, um, from our experience anyway, that people would ask us about is, will it basically play an XVID MP3 AVI? XVID is the video codec, MP3 is the audio codec. So whether people realize that or not, that's actually what they have, okay? And they'll just, you know, people just call it an AVI file. But as I previously explained, an AVI is not just an AVI. It, it could be any variation of many, many different things. So, um, as I say, XVID MP3 is the most common AVI that we find anywhere that people uh, inquire about. So, uh, just to play it back, we'll just hit the OK button. And you can see it there. It'll come up sort of in, um, sorry, I hit the wrong button there. I'm just going to hit the exit button there for a second and go back in uh, apologies there so if you want to play back there your xvid mp3 just simply press the ok button you can see it initializing and it'll come up in thumbnail format so what you do then at that point then is just press the red button and it'll you know enlarge it to full screen so um that's basically it and just to get over then all you have to do is hit the exit button if you want to stop the play back in the thumbnail, just hit the stop button. So that's it in a nutshell. And just to get back to live TV, then all you have to do is simply hit the exit button a few times and you're back to live TV. So that's a little bit about the media player on the TV Star T2 505 HD uh, digital terrestrial receiver.